What's going on, guys? Drawing the dogs here. Welcome back to the channel. All right, guys, I'm out here with this RC Monster HyperGo 116 scale brushed buggy, guys. Brushed, yes, and we are running it on 3S LiPo. I got an Ovonic 2200 35C LiPo in there. And it's not even strapped down. I just kind of smashed the body down on. You can kind of see the body a little bit leaned up to one side a little bit. You can kind of see a little bit. But uh, yeah, got a 3S LiPo in there. Now they do say it on the specs on the website or not on the, well, on Amazon anyways, where I got it from, that is could run 3S. Now I did do a, a quick speed test of just running it on 3S and it did do 24 miles per hour, but that was just a speed test run. So we're going to see if this guy can actually run uh, 3S LiPo without going kaput. So you can see it's uh, really in up there. You can definitely tell it's a 3S in that bad boy. So let's go. Like I said, I did the speed test on it. You can check that. Got 24 miles per hour. Not bad for a 390 brush motor. But it is running this bad boy. It's, uh, it's about uh 60 degrees right now so it's not super hot but it's not cold either so we'll see what this motor does Think for the price, this thing is still currently sitting at fifty-five dollars, guys. Fifty-five dollars, and it comes with two. It comes with two S batteries, but still, it comes with two two S batteries, and they're eight hundred and fifty milliamp hour batteries. And on a stock two S battery, we're gonna get about 17, 18 miles per hour, about eighteen miles per hour. It's not bad, but like I said, a one sixteen scale little brush buggy. Thing. Look at this thing go. So, you see it's handling the 3S. I not see no smoke yet. This grass is still wet from the early morning dew. Still early. Oh, you flipped it. Now the tires are all wet. Still yeah, handling really good though for a buggy. Some thicker grass. Usually buggies don't handle that well in grass or thick terrain, but this thing is handling it. Cause I'm tired. Ooh. Ooh. Couldn't catch it. All kind of stuff caught up in my wheel now. With that wet grass. Pretty hard right there. I heard that. Y'all heard that? Sound like a bone breaking. Mm. Mm. Tough little buggy. Definitely a tough little buggy. I'll give it that. We all know these hyper goals are tough. We've seen plenty of YouTubers put these things through the through the ringer. So this should be no different. But the oil filled shocks feel so good. All companies to be just put oil filled shocks on your vehicle. It doesn't cost that much. Come on now. These feel so good. 
And this is only a 55-hour RC. And they was able to put oil fresh shocks on it. I mean, come on. Pay attention, everybody. Pay attention to all you RC companies. If they can do it for 55 bucks and give you two lipos, oil fresh shocks, come on. All you other guys can do it too. This thing is running at 3S. That's not bad, guys. You gotta see, you gotta think. Ooh, that hit hard. You got um, you got an RC car that's brush, yeah, but for 55 bucks, this thing is running a 3S lipo. So that's pretty good. I totally missed it. That's pretty good, guys. I'm impressed. I'm gonna get down so I can get on this ramp. Got that blind spot coming down. All right. In that moment, let me open this up and see how hot this motor is getting. Let's check this motor. Three S's in there. Check this motor. I mean, it's warm, guys. It's warm. Not the same as what it was in the two S, though. It's pretty warm, though. Yeah, it's pretty warm. So, I just said, just keep your keep an eye on it. You know what I'm saying? I'll let it cool off for a minute. But that's a quick run of this bad boy. It can run the 3s lipo you guys there you go quick 3s run this thing took it like i said it's warm but it's not like overheating you know, smoking hot it's warm but it's warm though i say it's warm so keep an eye on it running it 3s but it can take it so i'm your boy john the dogs let's get to like subscribe catch you guys in the next episode Toast.